Hello friends, welcome to Eltropic Cells. If you like our channel, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe and press the bell icon for getting further notifications. Hi friends, it's a 43 inch Micromax Smart Android LED TV. In this TV, the complaint is remote not working issue. Here, while checking, we found that the remote is working properly. Here actually, the fault is with this sensor. See friends, we can see the IR is working properly. So here, the fault is not with the remote. Here, the fault is with this sensor module. See friends, now we removed the sensor module from the TV Now we need to check for any shorting or capacitor leakage in this sensor module before replacing the IR sensor So let us check for any PF capacitor short in this sensor module first before trying to replace the IR sensor. See friends, now we put the multimeter in continuity mode. Now let us check for any shorting in this PF capacitor. See friends, you can see the buzzer beep sound. See friends, it means that this capacitor is short. So this is the reason for remote not working issue in this smart TV. So here actually the fault is with this capacitor. So no need to replace the sensor from this IR module. We need to remove this faulty SMD capacitor. See friends, now let us remove this shorted faulty capacitor from this module circuit. See friends, now we removed the capacitor from this board. See friends, after removing this capacitor from the circuit, you can see it shows shorting. See it again shows the shorting. See friends, while checking the module, now the shorting is removed. So friends, here we reconnect the sensor module back to this TV. Now let us check the remote is working or not. See friends, you can see now using this remote, the TV is released from the standby. See, now the TV is turned on. Since it's a Android LED TV, it takes time for booting. So. We need to wait until the boot animation is finished. See friends, now you can see the home page. See friends, now the remote is working properly. You can see the volume buttons are working. Now let us 
check the youtube button see friends youtube is also opening so it means that now the remote is working properly after removing the shorted pf smt capacitor so now the work is done and the tv is repaired successfully so that's it hope you like this video see you in another video with another interesting topics if you like our channel please don't forget to like and subscribe and press the bell icon for getting further notification thank you for watching